President Biden was one of several who paid their respects to late Senator Harry Reid, who was lying in state at the Capitol on Wednesday. The president visited the U.S. Capitol, where Harry Reid is lying in state. The former senator from Nevada served in Congress from 1987 to 2017 and was the Senate Majority Leader from 2007 to 2015. President Biden spent a few reflective moments beside Reid's casket on Wednesday, and Harry Reid passed away on December 28th. The latest numbers indicate consumer prices jumped 7% in December from the same month last year. That's the highest rate of inflation since 1982 as prices for groceries, rent and other needed items continue to rise. Supply chain bottlenecks are still around and a factor in these rising prices. However, the rise in prices is less than what we saw in November, which jumped 0.8% from the month before. In December, that increase was only 0.5% and the energy index for both gas and natural gas prices fell 0.4% in December. House Minority Leader Kevin McCarthy says he will not cooperate with the January 6th committee. The House Select Committee investigating the January 6th attack on the Capitol requested Wednesday that House Minority Leader Kevin McCarthy voluntarily provide information about his communications with then-President Trump and White House Chief of Staff Mark Meadows. In a letter to Representative McCarthy, the committee's chair, Representative Benny Thompson, said the panel was interested in his conversations with Meadows before the 6th and his conversations with Trump during and after the riot, among other, others. Excuse me. In the statement McCarthy wrote, the committee's, quote, only objective is to attempt to damage its political opponents. McCarthy is the latest Republican House member whose cooperation has been requested.